So, <sighs> recently I have been doing a lot of crafty things. I've been doing a little embroidery, I've been doing some woodworking, and just like really testing my crafting abilities. So I decided to recreate, no wait, not recreate. I'm getting all cocky. <laughs> recreate, who am I? I'm not a painter. So I am going to be following a Bob Ross tutorial today. You've probably seen some of these around. They are pretty good. So let's lower the expectation for mine. Also. I just found out that these paints are actually pretty toxic, so that's fun. The painting tutorial that I'm following is super pretty, but looks really complicated considering my current painting ability. Let's do it. I already lost all my things. Um, where's my big brush? <laughs> I'm ready. If this is your first time with us, I hope you grab a few paints and some brushes and come along and paint with us. I'm doing the liquid white. I don't know if I have enough of this. This canvas is a little bigger than I thought. Ah! <laughs> no! <clears throat> I'm just also choking. This is already off to a fantastic start. What the heck? Not my best choice in something to hold up my easel. A crate with lots of holes in it. You know, this is just, I think, part of being a painter. Speed bumps and curve balls are just a part of the journey of a beautiful painting. I'm not gonna lie. I just got actually really nervous about this. I don't think this is right. Oh, this feels right, yeah. This is the stroke. I'm gonna tap the brush. Tap. Little crisscross strokes. <gasps> Just make little X's. Oh, let's wait, put in a happy that? little cloud. How does little he sky. Do that so fast. How is he actually doing that with his hands? <laughs> crisscross. I need to rewind this. I can't do this crisscross thing. Also, why is mine so much lighter than it's supposed to be? I need to fix this. I'm really anxious about this right now because now I actually want to do a really good job. It's so hard. I'm sorry to real painters out there that are probably just watching this in absolute disgust. Oh no, I made my sky too low. Pull. Pull. across like this. Very gently. I'm having some serious self-doubt right now. <laughs> Oh, this isn't working! Oh no! This is really bad. Give a towel. Oh no! So, yeah, I don't know what just happened. We're gonna keep going. And these are just little floaters, little happy clouds. So I've learned I'm not the best at painting clouds. Um, actually painting anything for that matter. Oh no! What even is it? Oh no! I'm falling behind so much. We're doing mountains. Right over like that. Now scrape off all the excess paint. Here I'm just really using firm pressure. I feel like my mountains are a little crooked. Okay, so this is as good as I can get the mountain. Um, also, I realized that we were supposed to leave some white between the ocean and the mountain, and I failed to do that. So we're gonna hope this turns around. Let's put some snow on this mountain. Snow. For okay. that, I'll take the titanium white and pull it out oh, very like flat. Hair. Where are your lights coming from? You have to start making some big decisions now. I'm not ready for the big decisions. Touch, no I'm pressure, so just the weight of the knife, no pressure. All of my colors are mixing together. It may be hard to believe, but I'm actually trying really hard to make this look as good as possible. Pretend that if you're not careful, your hand will just literally float away. See, you can bring it right in front. You can move Whoa. the houses. You can do anything on this canvas. We just made a really big this decision canvas, right now. You have I'm proud of that. Power. Oh, no. Absolutely. I've never been so disappointed in myself. Oh, it's getting worse. I'm gonna vomit. This is not, I'm gonna vomit. Every stroke I do, I cringe. This is not me. This is not who I am. I'm better than this. I'm really hoping that the camera hides how horrible this looks right now. The snow is just really gross. I am 
not worthy of even watching this video right now. Can we talk about <laughs> what a mess I am? No! An oval brush. I'm nervous! Looks like just the tops of thousands of little trees far off in the distance. Look at that. Mm. I'm beginning to see a lot of flaws in my painting. Because there's like this weird like empty white space between the trees and my mountain right now. Blue. Now these are a little closer, so you're beginning to see a little more detail. Oh no. I got too excited. And just cut in a happy little border. Happy little borderline. You got it. Keep this basically straight. You can go anywhere you want to go. I don't know how to use these knives. Oh no. Guys, this is just a mess. Okay, we're going to move on. It's fine. Oh no, my trees are not looking like that. How do you do that? This blob, I don't really know if I can save it at this point because it's just like kind of getting worse as I'm going. And also, I think I used too much paint because I'm like starting to run out. Hmm. Oh no. Take that is beautiful. Knife. That is true yeah, really magic. Scrape in a few little sticks and twigs here and there. I look forward to seeing you again in the very near future. From all of us, happy painting. God bless. So this is what we have. It's a, it's a here. It's okay. It's not that bad. It's, it's like, honestly, the mountains were good. We were golden up until we got to the bushes. Once we got to the bushes, it just all went downhill from there. And then we were supposed to paint a trail. And once again, just like it just kept getting worse over time. But this is what we have. Yeah, this has been fun. <laughs> My hands are now possibly permanently painted green. These just look like blobs here. Honestly, I'm just really impressed with the mountains. I think that that was pretty good. Everything else is just like kind of not that good. Anyway, thank you guys for watching me follow a Bob Ross tutorial. There were a lot of ups and downs. I'm gonna go wash my hands now. So thank you guys for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye! Ooh,